It's seven something. I'm awake. I had a weird sleep. Um, it was like I slept hard for a few hours anyway, and then I don't know. It was like I was consciously sleeping. It was really weird. Or I wasn't totally asleep. I don't know. I didn't like it. Um, for hours. It just kind of seems like. I've been rolling around and, you know, could hear myself kind of snoring. Um, I don't know. It's weird. But uh, no one else is awake around here. See, I kind of wanted <laughs> my own little place. And that site that I could have gone to um, while it's in a campground is just full of trees like it's my own little spot so well whatever I don't think I'm gonna stay as long as I was thinking um, as many days because um, it's a little different without getting drunk so yeah um, I'll film some places today, but I don't think I'm going to wait until the one campground closes to film that one. Um, just because, again, it's going to rain, and today's supposed to be nice, but then during the night tonight it's supposed to start raining, and who wants to deal with all that for days? You know, and it's cold too, and it's supposed to get colder. So yeah, I'm going to put some clothes on and start a fire and make some coffee, I suppose. Okay then, <clears throat> I did already have a coffee. Um, people are kind of up and around and doing things, so I didn't want to film it. But I will now. I don't know why this is exciting, but it's, you know, it's something I'm doing while camping. The people, okay. Okay, so last night, it got dark, mm, dark, dark by 7.30, I would say. And two vehicles, so I, I ate that soupy mac and cheese, and then uh, I actually, so I ate all the noodles out of it. Oh, so this is a instant coffee, just to add a little kick, a little kick to my... Folgers. Um, so yeah, it's kind of good. Anyway, so they came and parked and of course had their lights kind of shining on me as they parked. They parked right next to me. And they're not, you know, they camped in their vehicle or whatever. Anyway, they're nice. I talked to them this morning, but... Um, that happened oh I ate all the noodles out of my macaroni and cheese and then drank the liquid cheese oh, it wasn't it wasn't pleasant um, it was weird <laughs> um, and then I went I stayed up I got pretty bored I stayed up till 10. Um, you know, had a weird night's sleep. Hopefully I sleep better tonight. Um, I'm kind of surprised that I didn't sleep so well. I was really tired and excited for bed. But uh, anyway, I got down to uh, 
30 degrees. Um, right now it's 40. It was 32 maybe when I woke up. And there was a little ice on my car. Um, what else? A little fire because it's cold. Okay, so I guess I'm just going to rough it and stay here. Um, at least one more night, probably two or three. I don't know. We'll see. But uh, I do want to put the tarp up, but I will have to. I want to move this table because it is movable. It's tied to this tree for whatever reason. Um, and then uh, set the tarp up because it's supposed to rain over the night. Yeah, and probably I don't have my pooper out here. I haven't pooped. I didn't poop yesterday or today. So that's got to happen. Um, other than that, um, I'm just having coffee and a fire. And, and then maybe I'll set up the tarp and stuff and then go to Alta Lakes. I want to film that place. I don't know if I have mentioned yet, but I don't think I want to stay here until... Um, so, I was maybe going to redo Sunshine Campground, um, but I have to do... But that's one that I kind of came here for. Um, they, I think they close either on Saturday or Sunday, and it's Tuesday today, and I just don't know if I want to stay that long. Um, yeah, we'll see what happens. Bye now. All right, so my plan is to move the table in that direction. Use, you know, that middle tree there to tie onto. And I'm going to use the swallow tail again. Um, there's a small tree behind me that I can use kind of to anchor. Um, so I'll use that and the table will be closer to the fire pit. So I'm going to have, in case, well it's supposed to rain, so I can still have a fire and be under the tarp. So that's my plan. Okay, I've got these tree straps, so I'm definitely going to use that for that, the big tree. It's actually a hammock strap go around the tree and then put one end through the other and then I can tie on or clip to all these different sections so that will help
Okay, well, I got it set up. People were coming and going, so I didn't film it all. Plus, I just wanted to get it done. Um, but I've got it tied to some trees just to help. It did get windy, of course. Um, the big issue is this. Oops, this part. But I'm not too worried. Um, there's not a lot I can do except to re, probably redo. Oops, it's really dark. Redo that one. So this should work for now. So now I'm gonna grab the wood out of the CRV, put it back here, and maybe put a tarp over it. Um, just because I want. I'm going to drive up kind of a gnarly road, so I want it out of there. Okay, bye. Okay, so now I'm going to set up um, a little smaller tarp here and put the wood in here and then cover it with the tarp and then I got to get going I gotta there's a couple places I want to film today um, I, and it's past noon already oh my god <laughs> just said a whole bunch but it was on time lapse so here we go again I'm back at Priest Lake at my site um, 
I don't even know, it's almost six. So I need to get firewood ready um, and start a fire. I'm gonna go head to toe um, under garments and someone was running on the road. Um, yeah, so I gotta do those two things. I did eat, I stopped in Telluride and got a 10 inch cheese pizza from Brown Dog Pizzeria, or Brown Dog Pizza, and I ate the whole thing. It was really, really good. Um, I did poop this morning, by the way. So, um, yeah, I left here pretty late. I, I probably would have called into my meeting today. Um, had I gotten stuff done earlier, but I definitely had wanted to get this up. And it is still supposed to rain tonight. Um, and in the morning. So I'm glad that's done. And um, hopefully, I'm just worried about this section here. I don't know that there's much I can do, but if it rains heavy, which it probably won't, but if it does, I'll probably have to get up and get the puddles out of the that's the thing that sucks about this thing it's just so big that it doesn't work for rain it's good for sun um anyway and why would i put it up then mm -hmm. okay so uh so yeah i left pretty late here i had a little bit of filming to do here that i got done and then i went about a mile south and got another dispersed area and then um, that was uh, Lizard Head Pass. So I got that area and then went up to Alta Lakes and showed you guys a couple, well, a picture and a video from Alta Ghost Town. Yep, it was really cool. Um, and then, then I drove through this other campground that's like seven miles out of Telluride. This one's probably like 18 or something. And as you go in it's pretty new i think it's new this year with fire rings and everything as you go in the host is right there so i drove by and um at the end of it it looks like a loop and normally you stay right so i started turning right and then i saw a jeep coming so i backed up a little bit and then went the left way and that dead ends at site number eight or something so then i turned around and then when i came back to go on to the other side of what i thought was the loop that uh jeep was sitting there and all of a sudden he's like hey hey stop 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 stop, stop. can i help you on the post i'm just looking at the sites sorry i'm like yeah he's like what are you doing i'm the campground host I said, uh, just looking at the sights. I'd never got out of the car or anything. Like, I could see if I was walking into all the sights or something, but I was just looking at the sights. Like, um, what, you think you own this or something? Oh, there's a bird right there. Hi, silly bird. I wish I could show you, but it's going to fly away. Bye bye now. Um, <coughs> so... That put me in a funky mood, but but then I went to Telluride and ate and everything and uh, whatever. So now I gotta get wood going and put my thermals on. Uh, yeah, the clouds are starting to roll in. Um, so I think at around midnight or one it's supposed to start raining and then into the morning. And it's probably going to be snowing here. So that was Telluride. And that's a lot further down than, than here. So I bet it will be snowing in the morning. Wish me luck. Bye.
got my thermals on. Um, just wanted to mention that later tonight, like when I, before I go to bed, I'm gonna lower this end up there and then this end to the ground just in case it snows. Um, I don't want the snow to weigh it down and then rip it. Rip it. Rip it. Rip it. Well, okay. It's, uh, oh, I didn't check. 10.38 or something and 45 degrees. So it's much warmer uh, than last night. Um, it's still going to be cold when I get up, though. Um, yeah. Had a good night. It was better than last night. I was kind of waiting to go to bed last night. And tonight, um, I had more fun, I guess. I listened to some music, and yeah, it's neat. <laughs> oh, and I had, um, Mike asked me um, on Messenger, which I didn't see until I got here, out of service, um, what's your beverage of choice or something, and I I had, I only had water last night, but I had a uh, rain, I think it's called, or frost, um, Gatorade. So that was my little treat. It was a bit sweet, though. <laughs> Just like me. <laughs> Good night.